If this hospital had a voice, what would it tell us? If it had memories, what would they be? Would it remember the people who work here? And would it remember the lives it has touched? We probably do the most important healthcare job in the city. Whether you are a lawyer or a doctor or a homeless person, uh, we make sure we give them the best treatment possible. If we were standing here today and this institution didn't exist, we'd have to invent it. Behind every great city, there's a great hospital to take care of the people who live there. In the nation's capital, that hospital is Washington Hospital Center. For more than a half a century, Washington Hospital Center has served the men, women, and children who call this great landmark home. The Heart Program is world-renowned for both surgical and non-invasive care. The hospital has one of the busiest cath labs in the world, performing close to 20,000 procedures a year. And that makes the physicians, the technicians, the nurses, the whole system very, very proficient and efficient. So nothing is new to them. They've done it so many times. They're true experts. The hospital center uh, has always made it, I think, relatively easy to embrace new technologies and new ideas. The center continues to cultivate new ideas, from imaging technology that seems miraculous by any standards, to new surgeries of unimagined precision. Washington Hospital Center was one of the first in the country to focus a program on women and heart disease. We actually have more women cardiac surgeons than I think any program in the United States. 10, 15 cardiac surgeon cardiologists, which is phenomenal. The cardiac unit has earned its reputation as one of the finest in the world. We are always willing to try new ideas. And that's why, you know, we continue to grow. And if the idea is good, and really patient will benefit from that idea, we are all willing to adapt. That growth is spread across specialties with programs in neuroscience and stroke, transplant, and cancer. The exciting things that have changed are the different treatment opportunities and the fact that, that survival's increased so much that over half of the patients are cured of cancer at this point, and that's really exciting to see as a medical oncologist. Cancer miracle is happening in the United States of America, and I'm extremely happy that the Washington Cancer Institute is part of that. I have more hope now than I did. It's different from reading in a book everything, uh, stage of disease and outcomes, and then seeing it, because it's never the same. I've seen miracles. New technology lets physicians look into a patient's beating heart and can attack advanced cancers without a single incision. Washington Hospital Center is at the forefront of this technology. That same excellence across specialties makes Washington Hospital Center the area's most indispensable resource. 50 hospitals in the D.C. region transferred nearly 7,000 of their most complicated cases to Washington Hospital Center last year. MedStar helicopters have come to symbolize this commitment to health care in our region. It's hard to imagine, but the doors of the emergency room have never closed. The ER has stayed open for more than 50 years, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 52 weeks a year. The Washington Hospital Center Emergency Department is the busiest emergency department in Washington, D.C. So we're the busiest trauma center, we're the regional burn center, uh, we provide transport through our helicopter program of bringing patients in. But most of all, we are the safety net for our community, the community that surrounds us and depends on us to be here uh, no matter what the problem, the medical problem that occurs. The nurses here in MedStar are, are very well trained and our focus, our goal is to save lives and it's actually pretty amazing to see how the team comes together to, to work towards that end. It's the central spot for the best medical care in this area. Um, and 
I mean, I know there, there isn't an officer I work with that hasn't told their family or their people they work with, hey, if I get hurt, make sure I go to Washington Hospital Center MedStar. That's just where we want to go because we know that they're the best. 50 years ago, house calls were the norm. A lot has changed in family medicine over a half a century, but some ideas never grow old. It's on in. The modern day House Calls program provides the best medical care and family support to those who may otherwise go unnoticed. With more than 300 residents and fellows in training, Washington Hospital Center has earned the distinction as a major teaching hospital. It's been taken a preeminent position in clinical care, patient uh, related aspects, and research uh, in the whole city and I think it really is a wonderful place. Watching what happens in a hospital at two in the morning when a burn patient comes in, there's no suits around, there's not all the other administrative support, it's caregivers in the middle of the night saving somebody's life. That's what I love about hospitals, and that's what I love about the Washington Hospital Center. The hospital center is a uh the most important hospital in the most important city in the most important country in the world.